Hi guys, welcome to my channel and today um, it's another day of my makeup and um, Christmas makeup challenge and I today have done for you a cut crease tutorial um, but it is a easy enough cut crease and it's good for um, day wear as well if you do like a bit of dramatic makeup. To create this makeup today I have used the gorgeous Gwen Stefani um, for Urban Decay palette and I've used a couple of eyeshadows from this. I nearly felt like I want to dip my brush into every one of them but I did stop myself and I used a few. So for those of you who are maybe thinking of getting this you can look through and see how the eyeshadows are performing, what they look like. Um, I absolutely love this look. I think it's so beautiful and a little bit dramatic but still suitable for every day. Um, and I love it. <laughs> Hope you like it too. If you do, please let me know in the comments below. Hi guys. So as you can see, I have my face already done and I'm just going to quickly show you what I've used. So I've used the Wonder Glow by Charlotte Tilbury and then my Naked Skin um, Foundation mixed with the Custom Cover Drops by Cover Effects. And then I've used the, let me just show you, the Shiseido um, Natural Finish Cream Concealer for under my eyes. This is number two. And then I've used my Laura Mercier Secret Camouflage and this is an SC3. And then I powdered all of that with my Max um, Mineralized Skin Finish in Light Plus, just using a beauty blender. And then for um, contour, I've used Inglot 508 HD Sculpting Powder. And for blush, um, Rocketer by Benefit. And this has seriously hit the pan, but I love this blush. And for a highlight, I have used Max um, Again Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Soft and Gentle. This is my latest obsession. I love this highlight and I love how it looks on the skin. And then um, I just set my brows as well using my Inglot's, um, what is this, brow liner gel in number 20. And this is like a really dark brown, but that suits my hair color, I think. And I've just prepped my eyelids and I've just popped a little bit of the Maybelline Color Tattoo in the um, number 91 Creme de Rose. This is from the Creamy Mattes Collection and I just basically put my finger into it and popped it all around, the, um, all over the lid up to the brow bone. So, exciting part. In this tutorial I'm going to be using the new Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette and just look at this beauty. Ah, isn't it gorgeous, guys? Look. And let me know if you liked a uh, full review, full swatches of this palette, which I probably upload anyway. Let's get started. I have a plan for this makeup, <laughs> and hopefully it will go as I planned. I'm gonna take a blending brush, and I'm just gonna take a little bit of the um, um, zone. This is that medium brown onto that blending brush and I'm just going to pop a little bit of that into the crease and again the same on the other eye so I'm just being very light with that very very light and I'm going to use the punk eyeshadow from the Gwen Stefani palette just on the tip of that brush and then just place that where I want my cut crease And then I'm going to take a, a blending brush and it's like a medium blending brush that's quite dense and I'm just going to blend that. And then again just going back with my small brush and the eyeshadow just Again, sort of intensifying that line. Just blending again.
Then I'm just going to take a little bit of the same um, Pong Kai shadow onto the top of the blending brush and just pop that on my bottom lash line. Alright, so now I just need to tidy up that because I want this to be cut crease. So I'm just going to take like a light cream eyeshadow and I'm taking blonde from that palette. And I'm just going to run this as I wanted to cut this sort of right here. Perfect. So now on top of that eyeshadow, I think I'm going to use bath water, which is this one here. I'm just going to wet the brush just with a Fix Plus, just to intensify the look. Then I'm just going to take the same blending brush that I was using. I'm not putting any more eyeshadow on it. And I'm just running that again through that crease. I'm just going to take pop and just pop that on the center. Just make sure that crease is right as it should be if you need to blend a little bit more. Then too. Then we're just going to move on to the eyeliner and I'm going to use my Inglot number 77 with a little bit of Dior line and just onto this brush. Okay, and then I'm just going to take my Charlotte Tilbury in black um, call pencil and I'm just going to apply that on my lower lash line. I'm just going to take my soft and gentle highlighter and just pop that right into there. Okay, perfect. And a little bit under my brow bone. Just loads and loads, loads of mascara. And for the lips, I'm going to use my Urban Decay, um, this is a liar lip pencil. Then I um, just have up here a sample of the Gwen Stefani X Girlfriend lipstick and I just want to try that because I'm looking for like a nude lipstick um, so I do want to try what this is going to look like and how it's going to last so maybe I can get it. Okay guys, so this is the final look. I hope you like it. Um, please let me know if you'd like to see any um, tutorials that I skipped today. For example, like eyebrow, my eyebrow routine. And I will of course see you tomorrow and have a great day. Bye.